I swear, people don't talk enough about what truly happened in the Nike Roche run. From 2012 to 2015, these shoes were absolutely running the sneaker game. With the sneaker being a simple, sleek silhouette that only retailed at the low price of $85 back in the day, it was hard to pass up on these. I remember thinking that Nike really hit the nail on the head with this model. You could go as crazy as you wanted with the colors or as simple as you wanted, and it would still look good. This really opened up the door for older and younger demographics to wear the shoe. As the shoe increased in popularity, Nike became more and more creative with what they were manipulating on future models. One of my favorite features on one of the shoes was the marble theme they had going on on the sole. And Nike also released a fly knit Roche run that I was all over and you were able to customize on Nike ID. That was really big for Nike at the time because fly knit was their new cutting edge technology. And at the time, the shoe was going very viral in the sneaker YouTube community. A lot of users were uploading videos customizing the shoes, and they were getting lots of views. Up until late 2015, the shoe was shaping out to be another one of Nike's iconic silhouettes, matching the likes of the Trailblazers in the Air Max 90s. But what happened next was absolutely devastating to the silhouette. The release of the Roche Run 2 on September 1st, 2016 ultimately ruined the Roche Run silhouette. For whatever reason, Nike decided to go for a more bulky look in the Roche 2, which I personally think looks a lot cheaper than the original Roches. You're probably thinking this is the ugliest colorway they got. Nope, not even close. I personally think this blue colorway is significantly uglier than the black and white one. Everything about this shoe just looks cheap to me and it screams like it was just rushed and thrown together. They probably received a bunch of backlash for the blandness and the cheap look of the shoe, so they tried to go the fly knit route again, but it honestly just doesn't hit the same on this model. 